I'm a surgeon by training and a pirate by inclination. Not much else to know, Captain. I like long walks on the promenade and the smell of Spacer's Corona. I make a mean zero-G cocktail and I've got a meaner right hook. It's a mix of whatever you've got on hand. Usually zero-G brew with some Spectrum vodka if you're lucky. Purple berry shake if you're not. Sounds good. Inventive, I like I'll it. I'll make you one sometime. If you don't enjoy it, I'll make a few more until you do. I like her. Sure do. Some of it was even legal. Oh, wow. How dare you? What gave it away? It's the hair, right? Or maybe the ammo belt? I had it custom made. Your casual outlook on legality. Gotta figure out how to work that into my aesthetic. Maybe a pair of earrings? <laughs> I've done all types of work with all kinds of crews. If there's one thing you ought to know about me, it's that I won't tell you your business. Your ship, your way. That sounds reasonable. Glad to hear it. It's worked for me this long. Well, my blood type is AB positive. I'm a Leo, and I despise Space Hospital. Never mind what anyone else tries to tell you. <laughs> that about covers it. Oh, come on. That stuff's boring. <laughs> Look, the thing I've learned about living in close quarters is that you've got to give people room to breathe. I'm all for making a few bits together and having fun doing it, but let's keep a little professional distance. All right, fair enough. No complaints here. Good to see you, boss. Didn't I tell you? I'm secretly the chairman's orphan child, abandoned at birth in the back bays. And then you were raised by a pack of sprats, right? That's right. Can't get anything past you, boss. I like this guy's sense of humor. Honestly, before you pick me up, I was living in the back bays. I spent my whole life up there, watching ships roll in and take off. I always wondered where my ship would come. I was what folks on the groundbreaker call a stowaway. Means I was invisible. Life carried on for everybody else, but not for me. I had to make my own way. That's what they called us. Orphans with no family, no company to take us in, nowhere to go but the back bays. The word's a touch kindlier than rung leech, but the meaning's just as clear. If you can't support your own self, you don't deserve to be on the groundbreaker. Same way we all do. Look for work and hope somebody would give me a shot. Hauling boxes was about the only work I could find. Hated every second of it. The foreman and I never got on. Could be I was overreacting. A better man might have turned the other cheek. Exercised a little bit of that, what's the word? Restraint? <laughs> But on the other hand, broadsiding the jackass with a toss ball stick, that felt good. <laughs> Real good. <laughs> you try it. Oh, I can do civilized. Proper civilized, too. Genuflecting and everything. I caught a real lucky break. If you hadn't picked me up, I'd still be back at the docks, waiting for the day my ship arrives. <sighs> yeah, I guess my ship did arrive in the end. I've got you to thank for that. Thanks for well, here's hoping boss. I don't get you killed, Felix. Let's get going. We. Ah. We again. Ow! I will never learn. So she carries an auto mag pistol for plasma and. A corrosive blade. I'm okay with those, although she could probably make use of that assault rifle. Her main skill is engineering, medical, and lying. I like it. Uh, let's go with more medical. Why not? Allow me to heal myself more while she's here.
Yeah, I'm definitely getting her perks. Those are nice. What's she wearing? Right? I don't have any armor for her, so... She'll lose a lot of armor with this, but it's worth it. Because she looks fucking cute with them. He's got a grenade launcher and a toss ball stick. Good combination. Oh, I don't need you to be persuasive. I need you to face tank, please. Ooh, corporate enemies. Nice. Yeah, I need to give him heavy armor. For now, he'll take that. What will this take? 19 parts? Alright, that works. Now, I did make some use of this. I don't think I want to turn it into a shock pistol, though. Their stuff is coming in fully upgraded, which I'd like. This is my armor. I don't think I have an armoring slot now. Oh, hey! That's better than mine, and it's got a backpack. Excellent. Oh, someone else is using it. I'm guessing it's Max, yep. I can't remove it if I don't have anything to replace it with, damn it. Oh, okay. That's annoying. I think I'm going to leave my companion stuff alone. Except for that one, of course. Yeah, let's just give these things all a standard upgrade. Ooh! Nice. How's that an ultra rare one? There we go. I guess people don't want to spend their money upgrading equipment. It's better than buying new shit. Alright, next thing. Travel to that relay. Uh, I need to get a science weapon from there. I need a bunch of stuff, really. Welcome back, Captain. Hi, Ada. How can I be of assistance? Yes, Captain. Beginning playback now. There's, there's viscera and death everywhere. Gunfire, gnashing teeth, the unemployed. For law's sake, if anyone's receiving this, please send help. What? Uh, no! No, no, no! He Captain, did! We are now capable of accessing the Roseway landing pad. Also, corporate protocol requires that all distress signals include a list of key personnel for retrieval. The embedded names are Anton Crane, Von Cortez, and Orson Shaw. Okay, whoops. <clears throat> oh, you do not wake me if I am sleeping upon your return.
There's something to do on Terra. That's for the main story. This is the orbital array I need to fix. I think I'll do the side quests first. That place looks friendly. <laughs> All right. And just for... Yep, going with the new peoples. <sighs> Ugh. If I'm building out a squad, I don't really need Felix because persuasion is my strong point. But Ellie's abilities for healing are going to be great. That basically lets my inhaler heal a base of 45%. So I go into my skills, medical, now adjusted at 60. So I think my base for the healing is 45%. And then an additional 60% on top of that, the final total of that 40%. So it's not like it's 100% healing. Which would be great, but completely broken. All right, hush enough. Who's living in a relay station all the way out here? Perfect spot for some peace and quiet. Some robots. And here I was thinking I didn't need to put shock on any of my weapons. <laughs> Give this weapon a shot, see how it works. I was going to say, it would not be smart to pass this. Try to get past this. There. Alright, uh, that uses way too much ammo for what it does. Mine's hurt a lot. Of course, I don't have the mag picks for this. <clears throat> hey, tactical shotgun, nice. So I did the first half of this morning stream trying to find one of those, and I'm finding tons of them now. Jesus, you're taking a fucking pound and Alright, so maybe that assault rifle isn't as good as I was hoping against these guys. Maybe I really should have put a shock weapon. My inventory. Hey, more mag picks. There we go. Hmm. I'm going to prioritize keeping the mag picks for Max's thing. Hi. And that I just don't have the skill for. Get. 
Damn it, Felix. Please do not run straight out of robot. You probably don't need my diagnosis, but he's definitely dead. Yeah, he's long gone. <laughs> I love these guys. Yeah, he I say you he did. Did I mean to do that? Just does a lot more damage. I'm gonna keep that because we are fighting robots. There we go. Nice and easy. Well, that was easy. Go straight back to the ship then. Oh, hello, Faith Ladybug. Think of it like Fallout in space. And that's how this game works. <laughs> Sorry, I haven't been checking chat. I'm not on top of my game, as you could probably hear. How are you? Hopefully better than me. This game was made by Obsidian. They were behind Fallout New Vegas, Dishonored, Dishonored 2, I think Wolfenstein as well. Think about that. I'm not sure about that. Hail, Captain. Your return time is within 14% of the expected value. I need to go to the Roseway for that. Well, I'm glad you're doing okay. We gotta go to the Roseway for two of these. And I gotta go back to this place for two of these. Yeah, I'm very tired as well. I, have, I got four hours of sleep last night. I did take a nap after my first stream, but it hasn't really helped. Oh, I hit the wrong button. That's also why there's no webcam. I don't like putting the webcam on when I'm feeling stupidly sick. Uh, <coughs> no, don't worry about it. I really wanted to play this, and it's just my bad luck that this cold is ruining its head on my vacation. By doing everything I can, I've been drinking tea, which I never do, I've been guzzling Dayquil, drinking lots of water, trying to rest. Anything with a decent chunk of salt in it, like, ch you know, salted chicken soups. The funny thing is I thought I was over this cold and went food shopping on Thursday, and I bought a can of chicken noodle soup. I bought a can of beef soup, two cans of beef stew, and five cans of chili, no beef, uh, no beans. When I should have just done all chicken soup because I did not realize how sick I was gonna get. Oh, the thing, the funny thing about me is, if I was this sick, my body would just immediately like shove the sickness to the side while I was at work. Because my work ethic is kind of annoyingly good. If I feel sick, I ignore it and work through it, and then I get home and I feel like crap. And it's my mom's theory, and I'm kind of. <laughs> I'm kind of thinking she's right that my mind won't let me feel the sickness until I have the time to feel it. This would. Yeah, I need to go to Edna and then I need to go to a bar. Guarantee you, if I was working right now, I wouldn't feel quite so bad. But I needed the time off anyway. So even if I am feeling stupidly sick during my time off, I needed the time off. 
itching to whack someone over the head. Okay, I mean heavy armor. 24, dodge and stealth, no. Of course, it's his only suit of heavy armor. I'll take it, I guess. It's going to my companion, who is currently on the ship, so I can't even do anything with it yet. <clears throat> this is Halcyon News. Hi. I did the thing. Give me money. My comm center already got an update ping from the backup relay. I trust everything went smoothly. Thanks. Hmm, that's odd. The only messages in the queue are encrypted ones. Looking at the transmission logs, the relay hasn't received a single unencrypted message in the past 36 months. Must be on account of some new security red tape. Well, whatever's the cause, the board and the Earth Minister will see it sorted. Thanks again for saving my derriere. I secured quite the payment authorization for you from Chief Jun Lei. Try not to spend it all in one place. I'll take the experience more than the money, but how much money did I get? Ah, I was hoping for 3,000, but I'll take 1,200. Oh yeah, I need to give Ellie some armor, because she's wearing basic armor right now. She has no helmet either. Her weapons are decent for what she is. She got 17 light armor with tech skills. And is medical a tech skill? It is. Ooh, you're here. It'll do a lot. All right, so she has no helmet, so any helmet will work. Preferably one that doesn't look stupid. Skill with handguns, and she has a handgun, so that could work. Yeah, I guess that'll work for her. 10 armor, light. She got 14 armor. All right. The rest of his armor kind of blows. Not gonna lie. There we are. Increased skill to hand goods and you're better armored now. So you won't die immediately in battle. Oh yeah, I now need to... Go to the bar. work do we get a table stand in a corner apparently you've never been out drinking get a table i get as many drinks as we can so the thing about Pavardi is i kind of like her but she also kind of likes someone else which is annoying but oh well and she's been getting a couple mixed signals from this one lady and she kind of wants to drink her problems away now anyone here with a name by any chance I guess not. I don't want to whip my gun out at everyone. There we go. Hey, Ellie. Having your usuals? Not today. I'm on the job. Never thought I'd see the day. A new face. What's your pleasure, stranger? <laughs> Some big shot down in Byzantium's holding auditions for a new adventure serial. So, yay. Another six of those next season. <laughs> What ain't I got? Uh, clearly you don't have anything I'm actually interested in. I don't like using alcohol because of the, uh, negative elements of it. Water without the hydrogen or oxygen. Alright, I'll take that. I guess I just talk to Bavardi and we start drinking. Okay, so what are we drinking? You're the expert. Oh, and don't worry on the price. I got this. Let's just 
Do it proper. Girl, I want to treat you. If you really want to get drunk, whiskey is effective. Uh, let's see. Uh, what do I want? Uh. Oh, no, that's just... That's on account of my not being able to sleep lately. Makes my hands all twitchy, you know? I've just been lying awake, thinking about what Jun Lei said, and... Feeling my heart shake. Let's see. If you want to get drunk, whiskey's efficient. Well, drunk's what I'm aiming for. So I'll take your word on it. Whiskey is great. I could use some whiskey right now. Didn't think you had it in you. I'm impressed. <laughs> oh, no, it's good. I'm, I'm fine. I just didn't expect it to taste like oh, propellant. Oh, so I can feel it suddenly. That's because you're not supposed to taste whiskey. I'm pining for June like something fierce. What am I doing? Generally or specifically. Yeah, I guess we are that, huh? Friends. Friends give each other counsel, right? What do you think I should do about Jun Lei? I think you should drink more and discuss it at another time. I'd give you my advice, but if I'm being honest, you're probably better off following whatever the captain has to say. Well, she talked about another girl, right? Isabel. Mentioned her by name and everything. Like well, that's the thing with whiskey know. is you drink it to get drunk. Very few whiskeys actually taste good. And the ones that do are stupidly expensive. So most of the time when you're drinking whiskey, you're doing it for the for the drunk, not for the taste. If you want to drink for taste, you usually go with a mixed vodka, wine. If you really like bubbly stuff, champagne. Some malt beers taste decent. Most beers, I think, taste like crap. Good whiskey does taste good, but it's stupidly expensive. No one says terrible, vaguely sensual poetry to someone they don't like. Exactly. Takes a lot of trust to hand over that kind of blackmail material. You're a pirate. Shut up. Uh, I don't know. I'd call it... Uh... Sensual, that's a lot. Look, girl, I read it. It was real long and rambly. She was telling me a story about her dad, how a lady named Isabel did all sorts of things to try to win his favor. This Isabel lady never quite managed to get her dad's approval, but they carried on anyways. Made something good out of a bad situation. Then it all went down the tubes. Do you think June Lay still has feelings for her? <laughs> Isn't malt what they call like salt licks? Uh, maybe, but no, a malt beer is just a beer that's prepared differently from your standard tap beers. I don't know too much about it. I'm a whiskey person myself. I try to avoid beers at all costs. 